Dirty Dinosaur You've heard it all before Honest but I know uh -huh. Left these years ago I was young and I'm old Still care for the void uh -huh. We don't need the past in our lives for tomorrow Never see the end of the night for sorrow What do we do to love? Happy Fourth of July! Oh, I'd probably take this off. So. Got a little bit of a bonus video for you guys. Not doing a food review, but we are slamming some dope food. Gonna get some hot dogs real quick. Yeah, you guys probably know in America, holidays are just an excuse to eat and drink yourself silly. So, little bonus, little hot dogs, little Wrigleyville dogs. We've never been here. I know, I can't. I've never been here at all. Am I off the channel even? Yeah, so we're gonna check it out. Let's go. Love is love. Love is love. Adi yo. How's it going? Uh, can we do two number fives? You want everything on the Polish? Onion, mustard. You want the hot peppers on there too or no? Oh, and the hot peppers. Yeah, onion, mustard, hot peppers on both. Yeah, that's exactly what I want. Too. Yeah, yeah. Mustard, onion, and four peppers. Yes, please. I just tried to take a drink of my pop with my mask on. It's a learning curve with this whole thing. Okay, guys. No, oh, thank you. All right. I need some ketchup. All right. Thank you. Have a good day. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Bye. be a bonus video in Chicago without a rickety table right on Clark Street <laughs> north of Wrigley Field. Are you gonna be like this all day? I don't know. Is it gonna be like this all day? I don't know. It's up I have to no you. room to sit. I got no room to sit. I'm sitting next to a guy who's sitting like he's at home on the toilet with please his legs spread. Please relax. Please look at me. All right guys, a little pull of sausage. Fourth of July 2020. Let's make the second half of this year way better than the first. <laughs> you know we could really use a W right now. Cheers yeah. dudes. Mmm, that is so good. Mm, 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 mm. Oh my god. Snap. Mm hmm. Need the snap, and you need it to look like that. Poppy seed bun, sport pepper, onion. This should be the Chicago style hot dog. Dude, the poppy seed, if uh, my boss drug tests me, mm -hmm. I'm about to pop on opiates. I have to. Poppy seeds! What are you guys up to today? Oh. Grilling out? Hot dogs, hamburgers, ribs, pork chops, snack salad, coleslaw, potato salad, 30 beers. Mm -hmm. Done. Flavorful meat love. That hot peppers tasty. I love those sport peppers. I just, I'm not a fan of uh, tomatoes on hot dogs. You know what's funny? Chicagoans hate ketchup on hot dogs, but they'll put tomatoes on hot dogs. What's up with that? The prime form's okay, yeah. but the tastier version's not. I mean, nobody puts ketchup on a hot dog. That's odd to me. That's a good point. That's just adding some little bit of sugar in there, huh? Yeah, corn syrup. It is great. Those peppers really hit the spot. If you were ever at a Cubs game or in Wrigley, this spot, you won't miss it. Just north of Wrigley, on Clark Street, it's open after games. I mean, just scarf it down, dude. And Yaxi's is open until like literally 7 a.m. <laughs> mm -hmm. They close at five, but if you're still in there and you're quiet, they'll let you stay. I almost slept there once. Dude, I, generally speaking, get blitzed for 4th of July. Who? Mm -hmm. I still might. I mean, <laughs> what am I supposed to do? <laughs> did you fall asleep or did you pass out? <laughs> Shut up! When you're in the military, oh, this is great. We had these big giant tables because we had like a four banger room with a shared kitchen. Yeah. Put two tables together and we brought them all outside for Fourth of July and when we were in Germany. Yeah. Beer pong, beer dive, and tables for food. Had all the dudes out there drinking. I was gonna see how many beers I could drink in a single day, so I started really early. I've tried that I think twice in my life, maybe three times, and every time I've gotten about 30 beers. <laughs> and so I did that for this time, got 32 beers, and got really hammered. My buddy Schneider got super, super drunk. One of my favorites of your friends. Schneider, oh, he's great. He's a monster in the best way. And we told everybody no foreign beers because it's America Day, like <laughs> as like a bit. Yeah. Because in Germany, you know, like everybody's drinking German beers. They should. They're yeah. great. Like, mm -hmm. you know, there's awesome beers. And this one guy who we like always kind of picked on because he's kind of a dweeb, uh, he came like kind of later. Yeah. And Schneider was hammered at this point. And he brought Coronas. And we had, they had a dumpster on wheels that we had rolled up. Yeah, to the front so we could like make it easier for us to throw all the trash away. And all of a sudden I just hear banging and I look over and Schneider's just took this guy's six pack when he wasn't looking of Corona and is just taking one beer bottle at a time and slamming, <laughs> slamming them into the dumpster, breaking all of them going, we said no non-American beers. And this guy wanted to fight Schneider so bad. It was well, so yeah. funny. Full beers? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Unopened. Imagine having a fresh like case of those. Mm. They're a little more expensive. Cinco de Mayo though, not today. I have a theory. Mm. 
Mm. Buses are louder during p pandemics. That's a fact. Every single time we film, I feel like the buses are five times louder. That's a fact. Um, pause for bus. And uh, one guy, my buddy Hall, he fell asleep outside that night on uh, four chairs that he just pushed together. I've slept on four chairs before. Yeah. You know a really underrated uh, sleeping bed in a pinch? What's that? Just like a cheap hotel lounge chair. Oh yeah. Dude, yeah. I'll sleep eight hours solid. That'll dude. do in a pinch for sure. Uh huh. No yelling on the bus! When you're 30 beers in and you can sleep on rocks. That's true, that's true. Shout out to everybody that sleeps on rocks today. I used to have a car that folded into a bed. The <laughs> Mazda Demio. Not even available in the United States of America. I had never heard of that. Yeah, I tried to bring it over and it didn't fit our standards. Headrest pulled off. Back seat, it was a hatchback. Back seat goes, leans all the way back. Mm -hmm. Front seat with the headrest taken off, folds down completely flat and lines up with the back seat and it makes a bed. That sounds comfortable. Slept in it many times. Then you can drink, well you can drive and drink and not worried about getting home. You can't drink and drive. But. Yeah. Okay, you're drunk. Give me your keys. And and I'm drunk, so I'll give you my keys. Okay, now we're both good to drive home. <laughs> I don't know if it's just the fact that I'm so hungry, but these crinkle cut fries are hitting the spot. Yeah, right? I mean, and crinkle cut fries are normally kind of like my what, least favorite whatever, usually, you know? Yeah. These are very good. Why I, cut like this? I don't know. They look like, you know when you're a kid in kindergarten? I don't remember. And they got Maybe. those weird scissors. Yeah. Yeah, I do know exactly. They make those what you mean. weird designs. That yep. seems like that's what they're cutting these with. Is they, that the crinkle scissor? Somebody who like invested in this company like threw a bunch of potatoes down on the kitchen island and told their son or daughter yeah. to take those scissors from school and just start chopping. Uh huh. <laughs> and that's how crinkle cut fries were born in America. Mm -hmm. Listen, I made a great reporter out of you, Hildy, but you won't be half as good on any other paper, and you know it. We're a team. That's what we are. You need me, and I need you. I have three lightning round questions for you. I just oh, of. oh, awesome. Wow. Fourth of July, lightning round. Okay. I think I know your answers, but I want you guys to comment your answers. All right, are you ready? Yes. Cue the lightning. Thank you. <laughs> if you could only drink one beer for the rest of Fourth of July ever, which beer is it? Natty Light. If you could only eat one thing off the grill at a barbecue for the rest of your life on Fourth of July, what item off the grill do you get? Hamburgers. If you could only have one fast food to substitute on Fourth of July, you're not allowed to grill out, which fast food do you get? Rallies. What do you guys think? All day IPA from Founders. Dumb. Bratwurst. Stupid. I was gonna say Burger King. Burger King, great. Because their burgers taste like smoky and grilled. Yeah. And that feels kind of more to me like America's fast food spot. Unless you've thrown up in a Burger King bathroom, you're not American. You know? Fly the W. I'm really uh, impressed with your uh, appetite. Oh yeah. I haven't touched a single morsel of food today. Mm. Bet you didn't think you'd hear the word morsel today. I just didn't think I'd hear it from you. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> Shout out to Red Gold Ketchup. Is Sprite your favorite pop? Well, yes and no. Or I should guess I should say like, yes, disclaimer, it's a really tight race with uh, Sunkiss. Oh wow. Or any orange soda really. I'll use it as a mixer. Yeah. Not a lot of people use orange soda for their alcoholism. Kel, I do. Kel did. Who loves orange soda? <laughs> Kel loves orange soda. Oh, like I know he drank it, but I didn't know that was for his alcoholism. I didn't know he was drinking booze with that. When he was popping into that convenience store that Keenan worked at. That makes sense. That's why Keenan made it and Kel never did. Kel had too much of a drinking problem. Yeah, and it was attributed to all that orange soda. Mmm. We haven't lived until you've had plastic bottle gin and sun kissed. Fago Rock and Rye is my favorite pop. Oh. What'd that guy just do? Spit. He went, walked out of his business and spit? Yeah, you can't spit in your business, bro. <laughs> Can you imagine going like to a business and just some guy just spitting on the floor? <laughs> oh yeah, he's got a cigar shop. It's not like a restaurant. Mm. Not, I'm like, I just assume all rest or all businesses have sinks. You'd imagine so. Well, a bathroom, there. yeah. What a great day. Look at us. Look at us. Huh? Who would have thought? Not me. It is beautiful out. It's like 85 here. I hope everywhere's got good weather. Me too. America! America! Fuck yeah! This place only has like a two and a half star in Yelp. It should have a five star. Really? Well, have them. Those people in there are so nice. They deserve five stars. All those reviewers that aren't us should move to Europe. <laughs> Please talk more about how you hate Europe and bicycles. You think the Founding Fathers would be proud of the fact that they created a country where you can make a living eating food? Didn't Ben Franklin have syphilis? <laughs> yes, but I don't. All right, since this isn't a food review, we're not gonna rate it. That was just really good. A real quick, thumbs up or thumbs down on whether or not people should get a Polish sausage from Wrigleyville Dogs when they're over here. One, two, three. Boom! 
Yeah, dude, that was fan. I've never woofed down food that fast in my life. It's a trash snowball. <laughs> Guys, thanks for tuning in to this little extra bonus 4th of July video. We're gonna go slam a case of Natty Light. We hope you guys all enjoy yourselves responsibly. And uh, see you Monday for a brand new, brand new video. <laughs> I remember when, I remember when- July 6th. Comment and text us if you uh, if you guys are having a good hammered. Oh, I hope, maybe we get some drunk texts today. Oh, I hope so, dude. See the cell phone number? Literally text us your drunk texts. No feet pics, no dick pics. Dick pics are better than feet pics, though. Yeah. I made him get my beer. We didn't have Natty. <laughs> we fancy boys. Oh, gross, bro. Why is it so cold? Be safe. I like my beer cold. Ugh. Ugh. Sporting the good kicks today.